for your chest press, you'll need your heavier pair of dumbbells. Come on to lie on your back. Let the elbows flare out to the sides. Draw back on your low belly. Lift up on your pelvic floor so you've got some support for your core. And then bring both feet up off the floor. You're pushing the dumbbells up and together like you're drawing a big triangle. And one leg extends out a little bit. Dumbbells come back down. Foot comes back in. And then switching with the leg. If it feels uncomfortable on your low back to have both legs up from the floor, don't. Bring both feet down. And then as you push your arms up and together, you can lift one knee. So you're still getting some extra abdominal work. But because one foot's down on the floor the whole time, you have a lot more support for your low, your low back. Once you've done about 15 or so, you can put the dumbbells down and roll onto your side. Your top arm, you'll take that arm up to the sky and you'll let your torso open up and roll onto your back. The shoulders come away from the ears. The back of the neck is still long, still long. If it doesn't bother the neck, you can turn to the left. But if that hurts, look up to the sky or look towards the knees. Once this side feels complete, gather up the strength in your core, push your arms into the floor, bring your legs back through to center, roll to the other side. Top arm stretches up and over. Arms drop down lower if they need to. If the arms were hovering at all away from the floor, please bring your arms down lower or place something underneath the arms so they have more support. This should feel like a comfortable, safe stretch through the chest and shoulders. There should be no pain in the shoulders. If there is, adjust the hands, drop them lower, use support, whatever feels good. To build strength in your chest, shoulders, abdominals, and hips, do this exercise three times a week, 15 repetitions times three sets. Remember to not push through pain in your low back. If that comes up, it's a really strong signal to stop doing the exercise. Keep the legs out of it. Bring the hands to a prayer position. Let your head drop down. Thank your body for all its hard work. And thank you for joining me. Namaste. Thanks, Melissa. Now it's love outside.